Welcome back. One of those cold nights across the Twin Tiers tonight for sure. Most locations getting down into the single digits below zero. Wind chills could be double digit below zero. And that's why a wind chill warning has been issued by the National Weather Service. So dangerously cold stuff tonight, but uh, an improvement temperature wise as we go through the weekend. Warmer conditions expected upper 20s for tomorrow, even some mid and upper 30s on Sunday. But that looks like uh, we may have to pay the price uh, of those warm temperatures with a little bit of a wintry mix coming our way later Sunday and into early Monday. Doesn't look like a whole lot of precipitation heading our way, but obviously just a little bit of a mix could create some uh, slippery travel conditions. Outside right now, Crystal City Sky Cam, uh, we're looking dry at this hour. Not expecting any more snow tonight, but as the winds occasionally gust up to near 20 miles an hour, we'll have to contend with the blowing and drifting snow. Here's a look at our winter weather alerts. Uh, wind chill advisory for Bradford County. For the rest of the viewing area, including the southern tier, we're looking at wind chill warnings tonight. And again, some wind chills as low as 20 degrees, 25 degrees below zero. A recap of our uh, recent snowstorm, Newark Valley topping our list with just under a foot of snow there. Elmira coming in with nine and a half inches. Hornell not far behind at nine inches. Montour Falls, eight and a half. Corning at seven and Sayre five and a half inches of snow. No snow showing up on our radar map right now. In fact, high pressure moving in, so lots of clear skies out there. And with the clear skies and the fresh snowpack, temperatures will be tumbling fairly quickly. In fact, some spots already below zero at this hour. In Elmira, we're six, one in Binghamton, five the current temperature up towards Syracuse. Wind chills are certainly below zero, three below in Elmira and seven below the current wind chill up in Rochester. Local actual temperatures right now, four in Corning, six in Wellsboro, Spencer at one and two currently in Ithaca. 24 hour planner for tonight, clear skies down to about seven below zero for an actual temperature, 29 tomorrow's five degree guarantee, but lots of sunshine out there in future track just showing that as well with high pressure and control. No worries about any kind of precipitation for tomorrow, but notice as we go through the day on Sunday, increasing clouds and the threat for some rain mixed with a little bit of sleet and wet snow at times, especially Sunday afternoon, and that'll continue into Monday morning. Five degree guarantee for today. We forecast nine and that was our unofficial high. For the rest of tonight for the northern tier, sub-zero temperature, six below in Mansfield, five below in Sayre. For the southern tier, also looking bitterly cold out there, eight below in Bath, seven below your forecast low in Elmira. And for the southern Finger Lakes area, look for temperatures five to ten degrees below zero with mainly clear skies. First warning, seven-day forecast showing the warmer temperatures over the weekend, but we'll have to watch out for that mix later Sunday. And then that'll change over to snow showers on Monday. Another Arctic blast Tuesday with a high of two. This is coming high of two. Uh, high of two. <laughs> And this is coming off that overnight low temperature mm -hmm. Monday night of 12 below zero. And now Monday also the first day back to school for the large majority of the viewing area. We had a few schools go back this week and then we saw them get canceled. But so this will be uh, possibly any delays or cancellations. We want people to tune in to Good Morning Twin Tiers starting Monday morning. Right. That little bit of a wintry mix or snow showers mm -hmm. could slow you down Monday morning. And then just the bitterly cold temperatures yes. early Tuesday. Absolutely. Thank you very mm -hmm. much, Joe.